everyone, so today we are doing a very exciting video. In this video, we are going to be doing yet another huge haul. And today, not really from a questionable, inexpensive brand. This is gonna be a brand that is more like an Instagram brand almost. So now there's basically like two parts of this series. There's the like questionable, am I gonna even receive it? versus the, is it worth the money? Are these pieces as good as they look on the Instagram models on a normal human being? So yes. This might be the first installment of this category where we try more of the Instagram brands, but it's something that I definitely want to get into because Instagram brands are so intriguing, okay? The clothes look so cute. The outfits they put together, I'm just like, I literally never in a million years could have put that together. So to be able to just buy it off of like an Instagram picture is awesome. And now in saying this, I sure hope this brand is in fact an Instagram brand. For surely they send a ton of people on Instagram on brand trips and all these crazy events. It looks like a ton of fun and I'm just excited to try the clothing. <laughs> so as you guys probably saw from the title, today we are trying Revolve clothing and I got this huge box in the mail. Um, I actually ordered like quite a bit of stuff but they were able to package it up quite small which is very nice. Like here's the box, oh my gosh. Here is the box, so they packaged it pretty good. This is pretty hefty though, and it did rack up some customs. It got $120 worth of customs on it, so that's all right. I'm starting to get like super used to brands racking up co customs, so it's not really even that big of a deal anymore, but I do want to put it out there just in case you guys are curious about that because I know sometimes if I get customs, you guys too get customs, so it's kind of an indicator. So this one did have customs. With saying that, I think we should dive into everything in this box. I am so excited, you guys. Like I've never tried anything from Revolve, um, and I remember Every single place I go, there's always like a Revolve thing. Like I'm pretty sure at Coachella there was a huge Revolve party and like all these crazy things that I'm just like peeking in from the outside like, hey, what's going on in here? Like what's what's the dealio? So all right, without further ado, let's dive in. This is a little bit more expensive clothing, so let's see if it's worth it. All right, I'm just gonna dive in blindly, grab the first thing on the top. Also, I kind of want to address, I'm wearing a hat. I never wear hats. I don't know what has gotten into me. I'm just like trying to get into accessories, rings, bracelets, necklaces, hats, not all at the same time yet, baby steps, but like I'm wearing a hat. I haven't worn a hat in like for fashion reasons, definitely for blocking sun, maybe more recently, but like for fashion, maybe ever, literally maybe ever. So this is a big day for me. Not what this video is about, but I know you're probably noticed. I'm conducting a train. But okay, back on topic. So, all right, what do we got here? This is a leave me hanging, must be attached to return. Oh, <laughs> that's not what it's called. That's just the tag. Okay, so the tag says Flynn Sky designed in Venice, made in LA. So uh, is Revolve the brand that has many other brands under the blanket of Revolve? Cause already I think that's what it is. And I remember this, this is, oh my gosh. Okay, jumpsuits, okay. Another installment in my comfortable wardrobe. Fabric jumpsuits, you guys. If you want to be comfortable and look cute, get a fabric jumpsuit. They are so comfortable. They are so cute. In saying that, I hope this one is comfortable and cute right now, just feeling the fabric. I know it's going to be super comfortable. Hopefully it fits. On the back, the straps have these adorable little buttons so you can like make the straps a little bit shorter, which is a, a nice option, honestly, because not everybody is gonna fit everything the same. And this adorable uh, plaid pattern, it's like blue and red, it's more of a darker plaid. And on the bottom, it looks like the legs do flare out, which is so cute, oh my gosh. And underneath here, I think I'll just wear like a little uh, white or black t-shirt under this, and then maybe some sandals. I think this is so cute, I'm hoping it fits me. Uh, I think I got everything in either a small or an extra small. This is a small and down the back it also has a zipper. So let us see what this looks like on. I will make sure to put the prices on the screen just because this brand is more expensive. So if you guys wanna know how much everything is, I will put the prices. That being said though, with it being a little bit more expensive, I can feel the quality. Like it does feel really, really soft and super comfortable. And there's more than one layer here, so it's not gonna be like sheer, possibly see-through. So a lot of times when you're paying more, you are paying for really good quality. So 
that's what's going to the Tesla shot app. Oh my gosh, you know what I'm just realizing? The camera doesn't focus on my face when I have a hat on. So when I'm trying on the stuff, my hat will magically disappear. But okay, that aside, here we go. We've got the jumpsuit on. First things first, fits like a glove waist-wise. Like this isn't zipped up. There's absolutely no gapping, like truly. It is a perfect fit, like from here up, perfect fit. Now, I can't remember, I think they were supposed to be like three quarter length or a little bit short. So in that case, they're perfect if they're supposed to be a three quarter length, but if they're supposed to go right to the ground, my legs are a little bit too long for it. Like I think it's super, super cute. And again, like I was saying, it's so comfy, you guys. And the quality feels really great. <laughs> You can jump around, drop it low, everything's okay. But yeah, no, I think this is really adorable. It's a perfect fit and I think it looks a lot like the picture. So this gets a 10 out of 10. We like it. All right, let's see what's in this bag. This is like a mauve. Oh, this is a top. Oh my gosh, I did not expect this to be this fabric. This is like a padded, thick material. Oh my gosh, and look on the front, it's got like little design. What is this called? A little seam? There's a seam on here. And the sleeves are kind of like padded, puffed up sleeves. They've got little pulls right here, cinches. Wow, like I'm really trying to describe this. Oh my goodness, this looks such good quality. I was not expecting this. I thought this was just gonna be like a cotton shirt, but it's actually like, it feels like a formal dress feel. And on the back, it's got this big zipper, kind of like a statement zipper. I think this probably was a two-piece set, but I must not have known that and just got the top. Either way though, this with like white jeans and little boots would be so, so cute. So, okay, go put it on, make sure it fits. Okay, you guys, this quite possibly could be the best quality shirt that I own. I'm not saying it's my favorite look, like definitely is very cute and I could wear it to a wedding for sure, still waiting on 30 wedding invites. Quality wise, like this feels amazing. Like there's no way this would rip or tear. It's so comfortable and it just like, it's a great fabric. Like it's really fitting nice in here. And it's got a lot of give, a lot of stretch, yet it holds like a good form. Like, I don't know, this shirt is actually kind of just like confusing me because I've never had a shirt like this. Like it has structure to it. I really, really like it. Okay, based on the packaging, I'm gonna assume these are plaid pants. I don't know what has been my obsession with plaid. Is my hat plaid? It kind of is. It's like sort of plaid. Either way, I've been obsessed with plaid lately. This is not plaid pants. Oh my goodness, okay, this is a size extra small. But based on how it's looking, it looks like it's gonna be pretty big. It's from the brand Hours. Like, hours is in like, I'm five hours away from sleeping. All right, but the sleeves feel decently puffy. Like, they don't have like a built-in padding, but they are kind of pleated so that they'll puff up a bit. This is a really pretty dress, in my opinion. Like, I really like the way that it looked on the model because I thought it looked really classy, yet super cute. It's kind of like that, like, business, classy, party, what's going on look. Ah, I am so stupid. <laughs> But okay, again, just like all the other pieces, this one feels very, very good quality and well-made. I like the look of it. I just hope that it fits. And there's only one way to figure that out, and it's by putting it on. So let's put it on, okay? Uh, first things first, this style kind of makes me look a little bit boxy. Oh my gosh, it also looks like I have very pointy boobs. It just like puffs out. And I will say this does make me look like I have it like figured out a lot more than I actually do. The only thing is it gets really scrunchy like anytime I move, but with it actually like laying flat, that's super cute. The only thing is, is I honestly could do without the puffy sleeve. I think I would like this like a million times better if it was just like a tight sleeve. I just think that would look better for me personally, but I know my style is not everybody's style. So I will say it's super cute. It does fit very well, it fits all over, and it's a good length and just like a really comfy dress. I love long sleeve dresses. I just wish it was tighter, but it's still really nice. Okay, I remember buying some plaid pants. So are these them? 
maybe they are I really like the look of like trouser pants and oh my god oh my goodness these are so soft what the heck this is like oh my goodness they're almost like see-through what um you can kind of see my hand through there not really it's almost like this fabric is meant to do that like it is such a light airy fabric it almost reminds me of a really soft linen wow okay and again we got some checkers on here i don't know what's going on like i'm just really into it Hopefully these fit, I got them in extra small. They're from the brand NBD, so like I was saying in the beginning, I think that this is kind of like, Revolve is the company and it umbrellas under all these other companies that they sell, so that is not really, this, that's not a big deal in the slightest, I'm just saying. All right, got pockets. Looks good, hopefully these fit well. A lot of problems I have with these is they're not supposed to be three quarter length, but they are. So we will see if that is an issue with these ones. All right, warning, warning, warning. Comfy pant alert. You guys, it literally feels like I'm wearing nothing. It feels like I'm wearing air. There's nothing on my body. I feel like every review of clothing I do, it's like, all right, you guys, is this stuff comfortable? But I get that's not exactly what you guys wanna hear. Like, it is good to me for everything to be comfortable. But uh, yeah, no scratchiness, more importantly. And also, uh, the fabric feels really nice. Okay, that's still just comfortable. <laughs> uh, let's go with style. The style is nice. It looks just like what I intended it to, well, what I thought, what I intended to want it to do. It fits great around the waist, no need for a belt. Fits good on the boot. Um, this fabric I thought initially was gonna be like kind of see-through. But once you have it on, definitely is not see-through. And they are just like that length that, um, you know, that length that fits. <laughs> yeah, these are good too, you guys. These definitely get a 10. Very happy to have them. Definitely been trying to get more pants like these ones. So I'm happy to have them in my life. Oh my goodness. Okay, based on this color i'm hoping this is a skirt does this kind of look like a plaid as well okay no it's not a plaid it's just like kind of under the same idea i feel like like i'm so predictable lately but this is adorable this is like 60s inspired to me it's a little mini skirt and on the back it's got these adorable little pockets oh they're not real pockets but like they look cute like a pocket and they just got the clasp again two layers on the inside which is really nice so that you can ensure that it's not going to be see-through or scratchy this is from super down and it's so soft like definitely understand why this stuff has a little bit more like a little bit more pricey then again you guys like it's not anything crazy as you guys can see by the prices on screen it's not like four grand for this skirt but uh it's just more expensive comparatively to the other brands that i've been trying so i just want to put that out there but okay i'm gonna put this on i love a good skirt so comfortable for in the summer and everything oh my gosh you guys this skirt fits like a glove look at this i have never had so many things fit so well like this is this is making me this is warming my heart <laughs> but okay, this is adorable. It's got real pockets by the way, which I just noticed and that's like a huge plus It's so so soft the material on the inside is almost like a silky feeling and it just is like it looks exactly like what I wanted it to It's so soft and honestly, it looks really cute with this like white shirt Like this is such an easy and comfortable outfit like skirts is really it like it really is it the only negative i would give is this isn't like a stretchy material so if you were to like eat and like get a food baby it wouldn't really stretch for you but other than that i think it's super adorable i love the fake pockets on the back it's so cute yay speaking of summertime i got this huge fluffy jacket and i remember getting this <laughs> oh my god oh my gosh so soft oh my freak this feels like my cat straight up this is the softest jacket i have ever touched i am so afraid to own this i'm so scared that i will spill on it it's like silk on the inside and this really really soft fabric on the outside and it's this deep red oh my word this is so pretty and i'm pretty sure this was on like a crazy sale it's from mink pink 
Uh, usually I wouldn't buy a jacket at this time of the year, but it was like so on sale. I thought, why not? Snow is coming in like two weeks basically, so may as well just get a jacket now. But this is so cute. Okay, you'll be able to understand it a little better on, so I will throw it on, but just know that is the softest thing I've ever touched in my life. Oh my goodness. You guys, this is so soft. Are these pockets? Wait, what the heck? The pockets go backwards. Do I have this on backwards? Oh. <gasps> ah you guys, the pocket like lining can go this way or this way. So I stuck my hand in and it went like backwards, but really you can just flip it. To <laughs> <laughs> these are the things that make me laugh the most. Okay, anyways. You can hook it up. Again, I have no idea how I would style this, but like, this is cute. This was on sale, you guys. And I just think like with, okay, picture this. It's winter, it's cold out, you're cold, but it's cold. We put on some black high-waisted jeans, a white long sleeve top that I already have on, some black booties, and this. Pretty cute, right? <laughs> I mean, it's like a very basic outfit, but this is super cute, I love the color. Super soft, nice. Ooh, guys, there are so many cool fabrics from Revolve. Every single piece has felt so different. This is another skirt, by the way. I remember I bought so many skirts from here. Like, it's honestly not even funny how many. So there might be a few skirts coming here. Um, but this is a corduroy skirt. This feels like legit corduroy. Like, it actually feels like this could have been from the 70s, 80s. Like, it really, really feels like it. Well, I mean, corduroy is made now, too. But, like, I don't know. This just almost feels vintage. I don't know why. Okay, but the belt that comes with it is super adorable as well. Very, very old school circle. Let's go to the disco, you know what I mean. So I'm gonna throw this on. This would look, this actually would look, oh my goodness, this would look so good with the outfit I'm wearing, like with my white shirt and then this hat. Oh my gosh, cute. Past Mia was thinking about this outfit. All right, this skirt is really nice. It also fits super well, and you know what? It kind of poofs out, kind of cute, because I did cinch the waist with this belt, which is really nice because like, I do like to wear belts just to emphasize the waist. So this already having one and it like coordinates perfectly is quite a plus. Um, but this does like puff out a little bit. It's super soft. There's honestly not much to say about this one. Here's what it looks like on. There you go. All right, cute little pink silky shirt. Oh my goodness. All these fabrics feel amazing, you guys. This stuff does not feel inexpensive. This feels like expensive fabrics, like very, very soft. And just like, oh my goodness, like this is so soft. It feels like I'm holding water. Does that make sense? <laughs> okay, but here it is. It's just a pretty basic pink cami, like little tank. And on the back, it's kind of cool because right like this, it drops really low, like so. And I'm pretty sure this will be cropped. This would look cute with like black jeans and like some black booties. But yeah, this is really pretty. I'm not exactly sure why I thought I wanted this. I think just because like the model was rocking it so good. So yeah, we'll put it on though. All right, you guys, no sudden movements in this shirt. Otherwise it might just fly off my body. I'm wearing my bra because like, seriously, you guys, I've already flashed everyone in this household like 30 times. But okay, back is really adorable. If I didn't have my bra on, this would be like a very nice statement back. So just, yeah, you wouldn't want to wear a bra like this probably, even though it's nude and like no one can see it because it's nude. <laughs> yeah, you still wouldn't, <laughs> but anyway. This is one of those tops that like, I just don't know how to people wear it because like, I imagine people wearing this would be like dancing and uh, it just, like, look at, I've done like four moves and now look. <laughs> I just feel like it would, I would just flash people, but it's very nice. It's super great quality. And I actually think I could get on board with it, like tucked into something. You know what? Actually, yeah, I'm gonna give it a 10. I do like it. I'm just kind of scared of it. It's just so smooth. I'd almost have to take tape and just pin it there. Like, stay there. Ooh, okay. I'm pretty sure this is a skirt. This one looks almost 
like similar fabric to the other skirt that I tried on. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. Hoping so hard that this fits. This is so cute. I love styled skirts like this where they're like a mini skirt and then they have the ruffles at the bottom. I just think that's so adorable. And any skirt that is like a picnic fabric, picnic material, like it looks like it could be the picnic blanket. If it's a skirt, I think it's adorable. So strawberry shortcake looking. <laughs> Strawberry shortcake looking. <laughs> oh, this is from the same brand, Super Down. And this is really adorable. It definitely has a lot of texture to the feeling of the skirt. Got the cute ruffles. It's got lining. It won't be see-through. Wow, this is so cute. All right, this is an adorable style. Here's what it looks like on. It fits great again. All of these have fit like absolutely perfect so far. Fingers crossed moving forward. But here it is. Um, one thing I've been noticing with wearing skirts a lot is like sometimes when you walk around with like a high-waisted skirt Hypothetically, we're walking around. This is how we walk. <laughs> sometimes it'll like ride up and then like it's a little scary But this one doesn't feel like it would ride up like it's kind of more comfortable. I really like it This one actually gets a 10 out of 10. I like absolutely love this. Wow I got like the, a lot of stuff from the same brand without knowing it. This is also from super down I'm pretty sure this is a shirt. Now this shirt is confusing, okay? I remember looking at my order and being like, I will never be able to get this on. Okay, from the front, it definitely looks just like a basic cami, but on the side, it is actually like completely open and then you can tie it up right here. So with this, you would definitely have to wear like pasties or something or like no bra because otherwise like you got this complete opening on the side. Just looks like a piece of black fabric right now. I'll throw it on and try and do justice. All right, pleasantly surprised with this top, you guys. It isn't like as iffy I thought as I thought it was gonna be. Like, yes, it's completely open on the sides and it's tied up, but it actually feels like secure, honestly. Like it doesn't feel like two pieces of fabric on my body are just gonna like fly off me. It actually feels good. Like I'm not worried about it. Even with like no bra on or anything, like I'm not even stressing about it. It's pretty good. Like if you want to wear a shirt like this, definitely suggest this one because this is the most like their shirt that I've tried like this. Usually they just feel like they're going to fly off or like you're going to flash everybody. But this one doesn't feel like that. So that's all you can really say about it. It's nice and soft too. Ooh, oh my gosh, I'm loving all the stuff that I bought. Like seriously, I forgot everything that I got because I just, I order so much stuff online for these videos and I always forget by the time they get here what I got. But like, this is another cute corduroy, but these are pants and they look like they're gonna be like three quarter length flare pants. This corduroy is a little bit lighter than the other one. It's got a cute belt again though. These look so 70s. Oh my goodness, for like a 70s photo shoot, these would be awesome. All right, great quality. They're a little bit wrinkly though, so I'll probably have to wash them, maybe iron them. For some reason, I feel like you can't iron corduroy. That's gotta be just me worrying about burning it. But okay, I'll throw them on. All right, we got the pants on. They fit a little bit differently than they fit the model. They're definitely a lot more baggy on me and they are an extra small, so I'm pretty sure that's the small size you could get. But in saying that, I definitely prefer a baggy pant because I don't know it's a lot more comfortable especially with this because like it fits me around the waist which is awesome and then from there it just goes a little bit baggy and then it flares out I think it's super super adorable more like a boyfriend fit so it's very comfortable and on top of anything they look super like 70s vintage feeling like if I was gonna style this a little bit differently I would definitely play that up but yeah they're super super soft super comfortable Someone is driving a motorcycle by. Yeah, I really, really like these on. They fit great. So far, we're doing really well for sizing, so I am happy about it. Uh, I'm actually happy these aren't super tight either. Like, this is a lot more what I wanted. Woo! Okay, last thing. It's from Super Down again. Wow. They must have just been really my style. What are these? 
Is this a skort? Oh my gosh, I bought a skort. What year is this? Why am I yelling? I'm literally straight up just sitting alone in this room yelling. Okay, but this is a skort. On the back, it is these like little like uh, fabric shorts. And then on the front, you just tie it up right here. And it's a little wrap skirt. How cute is that? I have nothing like that. Feels good, nice and soft. I'll put it on. All right, here's the here's the skort action that everyone was has been waiting to see. You take the skort, you tie it up a little, and bada boom, bada bang, you have a skirt. There you go, people. No, but this is really cute. This is the first thing that I think is a little bit big. I should have sized down in this. And it also is just like a little bit wrinkly. Definitely would have to steam this. But I think this is really cute. I have no idea what I would pair this with. Like this is a little bit too elevated for me. But you guys, it's really adorable. It's super comfortable. Like this is so easy to wear. It's just like so comfortable. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Very soft, very lovely, very scortastic. All right, guys, it is time for the final thoughts on Revolve. I'm impressed, to say the least. Everything fit very well. I think there was one piece that didn't fit amazing, but even then, don't really feel like, like, I feel like I could still make it work. So I'm happy the sizing seemed good. The quality seemed amazing. You're definitely paying for good quality pieces. And everything did look like the picture. It did ship to me. The only con is all the customs, and that's not Revolve's fault. I can confidently say if you guys like something on Revolve and you want to give it a try, for sure you should. And I'm pretty sure it's an Instagram brand. If not, it's big on Instagram. So that this is the first Instagram brand and this is the first Instagram brand that is getting a check mark, thumbs up of approval from me for whatever that's worth. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If there's any other brands you guys would like to see me try, any Instagram brands, any questionable brands, make sure to let me know down below. And thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one.